Alfonso Davies is a superstar, period. He rose to the world of fame and renown on a Champions League night against Chelsea and since that day, it's been up, up and away. But who really is this guy beyond the pace and skill? Let us look at 10 things you didn't know about Alfonso Davies. Number 1. He has three nationalities. Alfonso Davies was born in Ghana to Liberian parents. He and his family later moved to Canada when he was five and in 2017, he officially became a citizen of Canada. So that means that the Bayern man was eligible to play for any of the Liberian, Ghanaian or Canadian national teams. But he seemed to have made his decision early enough as he represented Canada in different youth team levels even before he was a citizen. The month he became a Canadian citizen, he was called up to the Canada national team and immediately became the youngest ever player to make an appearance for the Canadian senior men's team. Number 2. He was born in a refugee camp Alfonso's parents are Liberians and used to live in Liberia until the Second Liberian Civil War broke out in 1999. The war displaced over 450,000 Liberians and the defenders' parents were part of that number. They fled to Baduburam, a refugee camp in Accra, Ghana, and the following year they had Alfonso right there in the camp. The little boy and his family had a very tough time in the camp. They struggled every day to find what to eat and drink. Living conditions were very tough and even much worse for a growing boy. Luckily, he and his family moved to Canada when he was five and slowly things got better for them. Number 3. He is a UNHCR Ambassador UNHCR stands for United Nations High Commissioner for Refugees. And of course, you understand why Alfonso Davies is an ambassador. The lad doesn't just love and enjoy the ambassadorial status, he actually does the work. Last year, he wrote a pretty lengthy letter to the refugee Paralympic team, motivating them to go on and conquer the world at the Games. He shared his story with them and encouraged them to continue to be leaders and an inspiration to the entire world. This is just one of the many things that the Bayern Munich man has done as UNHCR Goodwill Ambassador. Also, you should know that he's the first Canadian and the first football player to become a UNHCR Ambassador. Number 4. Numerous Records On the 16th of July 2016, Alfonso Davies made his first appearance for Vancouver Whitecaps FC in the MLS. That day, he became the first ever player born in the 2000s to make an appearance in Major League Soccer. That appearance, which he made at just 15 years of age, also made him the second youngest player to have ever played in the league. Two months later, he became the second youngest player to start a game in the MLS. In 2017, Davies did not only become the youngest ever player to make an appearance for the Canada national team, he also became the youngest man to score for the Canada senior team. And that's not all. He also stands as the youngest ever scorer in the history of the CONCACAF Gold Cup. But the one that takes the cake for us out of all of these is that Alfonso Davies is the first player born in the 2000s to score in a top-level international tournament. And that is no mean feat, especially when you consider that there are special players born in the 2000s like Haaland, Ansu Fati, Saka, Greenwood and many more. And I hope you're not forgetting that Alfonso is a defender, while these players we just mentioned are attackers. Yes, that's how special this lad is. Number 5. He currently suffers from myocarditis. Alfonso Davies has been sidelined for more than a month now, first as a result of contracting COVID-19, then later due to a COVID-related heart problem. After recovering from COVID-19, the Bayern man returned to training where he was diagnosed with myocarditis. Myocarditis is basically an inflammation of the heart muscles. It can lead to rapid and or irregular heart rhythms while also reducing the heart's ability to sufficiently pump blood. But the good news is that doctors said Alfonso's case is mild and not dramatic at all. He will need some time to heal and recover, but he will surely be okay. 
Number 6. He is obsessed with video games. If Davies is not on the pitch playing football or training, then he's probably in his chair gaming. And he doesn't joke with his games at all. You need to see him being very emotional when he wins or loses on FIFA. You can watch him play on his Twitch channel, That Boy Davies 19 where he sometimes broadcasts himself playing to his fans all over the world. Number 7. Messi is his idol Although Alfonso Davies and his Bayern teammates caused a lot of pain to Messi in 2020, the Canadian is still in awe of the seven-time Ballon d'Or winner and there have been many giveaways. One was when he nearly lost his mind after packing the Argentine star on Ultimate Team. Second, and probably more substantial, are pictures which have been seen hanging on his room wall. One time, much earlier in his career, fans spotted a messy wallpaper in his room in a video. And more recently, we saw him turn that photo of him and Messi in the Bayern vs Barca game in 2020 into a wallpaper and hang it in his room. That's how much he idolises the former Barcelona man. Speaking of Barcelona, number 8. Barcelona rejected him Apparently, before Bayern discovered and then signed Alfonso Davies, the lad was first offered to Barcelona. Former Barcelona player Risto Stoichkov had noticed him in the MLS and asked Barcelona's then-president to sign him. Guess what Bartomu replied? He's Canadian. No thanks. Well, that discrimination those many years ago is still costing Barcelona a whole lot as Davies has already caused Barcelona a lot of pain in his young career, while the Catalan club still looks for an heir to Alba's throne at the left-back position. Number 9. The fastest player in Bundesliga history There have been fast players in the German top flight, but none in the history of the league has ever run faster than the Canadian. In the game against Werder Bremen in 2020, Alfonso Davies hit a top speed of 22.69 miles per hour, breaking Ashraf Hakimi's record of 22.67 miles per hour. That same day, Bayern Munich sealed the 2020 Bundesliga title win. Number 10. He is dating a footballer Alfonso Davies is currently in a relationship with Jordan Hutema, who is also a footballer. She plays for PSG as well as the Canada national team. Jordan is just as talented as her boyfriend. Before she turned 20 years old, she had already become the highest scoring Canadian in the UEFA Women's Champions League. Also, she was part of the Canadian women's football team that won gold in the 2021 Summer Olympics. The two are very public about their love, and TikTok is probably their favourite place to express themselves. So, you know where to head if you want to see what a young football couple looks like. But before you go, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Also, subscribe to the channel and turn on the bell notification so you know whenever new content drops. 